All right, guys, just a little update, really. Um, just to tell you this little thing. Now, I don't know if everyone knows about this, so I just wanted to do it. This is by far the best setup you can have, I'd say, on Uber. So, let me just get rid of it for a sec. So, I've just dropped this customer off, right? So, there's the app. Yeah. In the Uber settings, and you want to nav put in the settings and the navigation, go to Setup as Waze or Google Maps. Plug the phone into your car, and if you've got Android Auto or Apple CarPlay, obviously there's your Waze, right? And then what you do is, give it that. Obviously, when you click Navigate to direct, obviously to go to the pick up the passenger to drop them off, it'll automatically go on the screen, on that, on Waze, and then I'll leave the Uber app open and on show just so you can see your follow on jobs and stuff like that um, yeah so you can see follow on jobs if they've cancelled any updates stuff like that and then the, the navigation doesn't overlay um, the Uber app it is really good what I'll do is once I, I've, do, I've got a job and I'll show you how it works and it is pretty cool because not, not everyone knows obviously that it, that if this is even a thing and it's so much better than having the nav overlay your Uber app. And also, it's a lot better than using Uber's nav, because I'm not a fan in general. But uh, yeah, I'll show you how it works once I get my next job. All right, guys, just got a job now, and I'll show you. So there's the, there's the information. Navigate. Boom! Straight on the screen. You can see the app, all the information. Little obviously overlay, and obviously the directions are there. Perfecto! I don't, I don't know what that is, but yeah. Hey, <laughs> happy days. Right, like guys, click the top bars in the corner. Account. App settings. Navigation. And then see. You got Uber Nav, Google Maps, or Waze, right? So you have it on Waves. I have Auto Navigate turned off because I like the little navigation button you can click yourself. And then once that's all set up, you're all done. Simple as that. You plug your phone into your car, Android Auto kicks in, and when you get a job, click the navigate button and it opens up on your um, car entertainment system. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the video, I hope it was very helpful for you, make sure you give us a big like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one guys, peace out.